I knew I was queer in seventh grade, which was a little bit confusing, but exciting. I think I would have found out sooner if I had known about the queer community. I came out as non-binary in ninth grade, which was exciting, and I use they, them pronouns. I like identifying as non-binary because I feel it gives me flexibility with my gender expression, and I think that using they, them pronouns makes me feel better because I'm not restricted by either binary. It just, it makes me feel really happy to identify as they, them, and when people address me with they, them pronouns, it just, it feels, feels like I belong, you know? The project idea happened after the Long Beach Lifeguard Tower, the Pride Tower, was burned down. I read it on the news like a day after, and I told my dad, like, we need to do something. And I knew that if we didn't do something, it would leave so many people in distraught. And so I was like, we should, we should paint one of our lifeguard towers rainbow. And so we talked to the city, and we talked to people we knew, and we gathered a community, we talked to um, South Bay Pride, and we formed a little group, and we just kept fighting for it, and it, it was able to happen. I'm really lucky to be living in such a supportive community that wants to uplift you know, queer voices and queer protection. I think what happened in Long Beach was a form of terror. Uh, it frightened Izzy and our family. It shook us up. There's, there are people in this community that are hateful. There are people in, in, in the South Bay that promote and speak of hate and division. There's an unwillingness from some to, to just pull down barriers and love and accept. And so those things scare me. But being involved in something like this, in a project like this, brings me hope. It fortifies us because it shows me that there are, there's a lot of us out there that are seeing it that way and we want to provide our children with safe opportunities to live happy life. This tower is supposed to represent the Pride community and it's to show their validity and diversity and everything that they, that they deserve. But I also want people to come up here and know that you know you should celebrate your individuality and uniqueness. It should be something that you're proud of, you know? You should never have to walk this earth being ashamed of who you are. And so I want people to just feel joy.